The Sesame Street Lead Away Lead Poisoning Prevention Project is made possible by generous financial support from the Prudential Foundation. What is going on here? Hi, Oscar. Elmo, Rosita, and Maria and the kids are telling everybody things they can do to, um, to... To help keep lead out of their bodies. Very good, mm. Maria. You remembered. <laughs> Thank you. But Elmo has a very important question, Maria. What's that? What's lead? Lead is something that's found in many things, like dust or paint when it cracks or peels off the wall. And lots of times you can find it around doors and, huh. and windows, like this. Oh, now Elmo remembers Maria. So if you want to help keep lead out of your body, you should play away the rust. What? what? Oh, no, no, Elmo, you mean stay away from dust because there might be lead in it. And you should stay away from peeling paint like this because if lead gets into your body, it can make you sick. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's right. Elmo remembers now, Maria. <laughs> Good, I'm proud of you. Well, thank you for that information. Now, could everybody please get lost? Oh, no, not before Elmo tells Oscar another way to keep lead out of your body. And that is to, 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 uh, give him a minute. I'm going to cut it on the tip of his tongue. Oh, no. Wash your hands before you eat, right, guys? Yeah! yeah. Oh, right again, Maria. I'm always so proud of you. Well, thank you. Wash your hands before you eat. Give those germs a clean sweep. And make sure you clean your nails. Put that dirt into jail. When you say your hands get sticky, that could make your food get icky. Make a friend of soap and water before you eat your bread and butter. Wash your hands before you eat. Give those germs a clean sweep. So make sure your hands are clean before you sit and eat your beans. Scrub those fingers top and bottom till every last dirt and germ you've got them. Then if you eat dark peppermint, you won't leave a fingerprint. Wash your hands before you eat. Give those germs a clean sweep. Great, I've got it. Wash your hands before you eat. Stay away from peeling paint. Now, everybody get lost. Let's go, everybody, from the top. Huh. Wash your hands before you eat. Wash, Wash your hands before you eat. Stay away from peeling paint. Stay away from peeling paint. <laughs> Very good. OK, I'm going to that's it. Let's go. Good, good. Now, everybody just go away. <laughs> no, no, Elmo, there's more. There's more things you can do to help keep lead out of your body. Oh, oh, don't tell Elmo. Elmo will guess. Um, no, 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 um, don't let him guess. Just tell him. We don't have all day. Elmo, Elmo, uh, leave your... Oh, oh, floor. Uh, ground. Oh, 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 Elmo knows, Elmo knows. Our feet. Shoes, shoes. Can't you see she's pointing to her shoes? That's right, Elmo. Leave your shoes at the door when you come in. Because sometimes dirt and dust that's outside can have lead in it. You don't want to bring that into your house. Elmo was just about to say that. OK, everybody, from the top. Wait a minute, uh wait a minute. Enough. I've had it. Who do you people think you are, anyway? The lead police? Sure.
you're not taking this seriously. And I can't believe that you guys haven't mentioned the most important thing of all. What was that, Oscar? Going to the doctor to have your blood checked. That's right. I just took Gabby and Rosita to the doctor this morning to have their blood tested. Hey, that's right. Yeah, getting your blood tested is very important. But how do you know about it? Well, I happen to be the one that's going to take my little niece, Irvine, to the doctor to have her blood test. It's the only way to be sure you don't have too much lead in your body. Right, Irvine? Yeah, right. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, what a kid, what a kid. Rosita, yeah. tell us about the blood test. Well, Elmo, there are two ways to do the blood test. Uh -huh. That's right. The doctor can take a little bit of blood from your finger or your arm. Oh. Yeah. Well, here's what happened when Rosita and Gabby had their blood tested. First, the doctor cleaned a little spot on their arm and took a little bit of blood. Mm-hmm. Rosita? Yeah? Did it hurt? Well, yeah, it hurt. Just for a minute, Elmo. But Maria held my hand and I brought my favorite dolly with me. That made me feel better. And then the doctor takes a look at the blood to see if there's too much lead in it. And if there is, she can tell us ways to help us all make it better. Mm-hmm. And the best part was, let me show you, they gave me this wonderful and colorful band-aid at the end. Ooh. <laughs> See that, Irvine? Yeah. <laughs> okay, got it, Irvine? Yeah. Now first, we're gonna wait for the doctor in the office. Mm -hmm. Then the doctor will come in with the nurse. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Blood test! Doctor can check you out. Yeah, well, doctor and nurses, it's our job to tell. If the folks will come to visit us or sick or well, gonna give you the blood test so we can see if you're healthy just the way you're supposed to be. Gonna stick your arm or finger, it'll only take a minute. You get some blood to see if lead is in it. If you're scared, it's gonna hurt. Close your eyes real tight or squeeze the cold.
a dog to take care of you. Yeah. Blood test! Blood test! And Gabby and Rosita's test showed they were just fine. Yeah, see, Irvine? A blood test is the only way to tell if you have too much lead in your body. <laughs> and Elmo is so proud that Oscar cares about getting your blood tested that Elmo's gonna give Oscar a big kiss. Oh, go away. Go be proud of somebody else. Uh, around the corner, or across the park, or on the other side of town, or on the moon. They should know all the ways to keep lead out of their bodies, too, you know. Oscar is right. Let's go, everybody. From the top, here we go. To stay away from yucky dust, you've got to wash your hands before you eat. Wash your hands before you eat. Stay away from peeling paint. Stay away from peeling paint. Leave your shoes at the door. Leave your shoes at the door. And see your doctor for a I'm sorry, Oscar. I, I didn't think you really cared about warning people about lead. Well, I do. I just didn't want them hanging around my trash can, you know? Yeah. Well, now, Maria, if you'll excuse me, I was just about to have my daily sardine milkshake. Well... Come on down, Irvine. <gasps> that's just great, Oscar. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.